Hey y'all, welcome back to The Kate Show starring me, Kate. Today I am sharing with y'all five apps that I am using in 2020 to help save me some money. So if you are interested in learning more, keep watching. So let's start off with my favorite money saving app. And if you followed me before, then this should not be a surprise because I have not one, but two videos on this app already. I will link them in the description. They are way more in depth. So if you're interested in learning more about them, go ahead and check them out below. But it is Capital. Capital is a money saving app that is rule based. So basically you link it to your bank account and then you set up different rules for whatever you're saving. So for instance, for me, I have a travel fund that I have created on there and I set up a rule to deposit 5% of any type of check that comes into my bank account. So that could be my paycheck from work, it could be a check for from my blog or from YouTube and y'all would be so surprised at how little you feel like is being saved but then it adds up so quickly. Um, that way when I go to book different flights and different hotels and stuff, I don't feel like I am, you know, oh my gosh, I'm putting so much money on my credit card or oh, I didn't wanna spend that $500 on that flight because I already have it saved away. And it just takes, it takes the thinking out of saving. Now there are so many other rules that you can set up. You can invest with capital, which is really cool. That's something I'd like to explore. Um, I will include a referral code down below. They are always running a monthly special. So if you sign up using my referral code, and when you make your first deposit, they will donate 5, 10, 15, 20 dollars to you, whatever that promo is that month. I believe this month it is five dollars, and then I also get an affiliate referral code of five dollars too. So if you're looking for a fun way to support me, that would be amazing. Favorite money saving app number two is one that I love because I don't have to think about it, I don't have to open it up. I didn't even have to pay anything to use and I get paid to drive to work. So this app is called On My Way and it was an app that was designed to basically discourage people from using their phone while driving. So I know all of y'all and I'm not innocent, I've done it before too, you know, but we really, we shouldn't be texting and driving. We shouldn't be Instagram storying and driving. We shouldn't be on the phone and driving. Our attention should be on the road and that is so important. And the really cool thing about this app is that not only does it pay you your mileage that you're driving for the day, but it also tells you how many accidents you've prevented and overall, who doesn't want free money? So basically you earn money like I said, for driving, and then you're able to redeem it for different gas gift cards, other different uh, companies on there. So I downloaded it back in November, just thinking like, this is way too good to be true. And I already have $200 that I can redeem for any type of gift card, which I think is amazing. So I love it. And the cool thing too, is that if you refer your friends and family, you will make a percentage off of them as well. So like always, I will include my referral code in the description if you'd like to sign up. I think that will be really cool and that way we can both curb our habits of being distracted on our phones while driving. So for number three, I don't have a specific app name for you, but what I can tell you is to go on the app store and download any and all of the apps of your favorite top 10 retailers. So for example, Target has the Target app, which you can order stuff on, but then they also launched a loyalty program called the Target Circle. So with Target Circle, I have been blown away recently at the type of discounts that I've received. The, I think two times ago, I got 20% off my entire purchase which is nuts, I ended up saving a lot of money. And then just the other day I went in and I spent $50 on groceries and their promo for that was you get a $10 gift card back to Target, which is free money people, who doesn't want free money from the end all be all Target, we love her. Also consider if you go to fast food restaurants like Target or Chick-fil-A, those are two apps that also have the same type of loyalty rewards points. They will give you free items like for your birthday or hey, it's 50% off, it's happy hour, frappy hour as they call it. Um, Chick-fil-A will even just like deposit free food into your account, which I think is absolutely crazy. But if you are someone, maybe you're a family, that's a great way to say like, oh, hey, I've got a coupon, let's go use it. Let's go pick up my free six pack of chicken. You know, something like that. Um, I 
it kind of, I think it's discouraging when I go to a, a, like a restaurant now that's just like fast casual and they don't have some type of program like that. Like I like earning goodies and feeling like I'm rewarded for going back to that same retailer, which obviously is the point. So switching gears here because I just harped on being loyal to your favorite brands. App number four, which is Ibotta, is a money-saving app that gives you coupons for different brands. Now, I like using Ibotta because they will offer different money back guarantees like i earned 50 cents just for uploading my grocery receipt the other day which i thought was really cool because obviously they're doing research and looking at what you're buying and what type of ads they should be showing you which i'm fine with you're already being tracked like i might as well at least make some money off of it um they also will include like i said different coupons for different brands and for me personally when i go to the grocery store um especially if i'm shopping like at like a target or a walmart i don't have a ton of brands that I'm like, I have to have this certain type of salsa. So if I see a coupon and it's for $2 off and it makes it cheaper than the other ones, I'll give it a try. Or, you know, hey, this is a coupon and you get money back. You're earning money by doing that. So again, you guys know the drill. I will leave a referral code in the description. Make sure to check that out. Um, I have never tried Ebates before, but I think it's similar where you get those cash back options. I don't know, I'm kind of undecided on Ibotta. It definitely requires a lot more thinking and I have to go in and check the offers every week before I go to the store. So let me know in the comments if you guys like it, if you don't like it. Um, yeah, just let me know. I'm, I'm very, very curious to see if I can get more into it. And last but not least, and this kind of sounds crazy, but it's two apps for my, you know, number five and that is TikTok and YouTube. So hear me out, hear me out. So I have recently become obsessed with watching couponers and I think what they do is so fascinating. I don't have the patience to like go super, super in depth, nor can I add two plus two. So I'm basically out of, you know, trying to really coupon seriously. Um, but I'm so fascinated with how much people can save by couponing and taking advantage of certain deals. And again, like with the points, you know, Walgreens or CVS will offer you 6,000 points if you spend $12 on makeup and yada, yada, yada. I follow couponing with Katie and she is phenomenal. I love her videos. She posts on YouTube a couple of times a week, but I've also found that TikTok is really helpful because they let you film up to 60 seconds on TikTok, right? So Katie will go to the store and she'll be like, all right, guys, drop everything. This is a deal that cannot wait for YouTube. You need to go. And she actually posted one about teeth whitening strips by Crest at CVS. And I got them for, I think, $4.49, which is crazy because they retail for like 30. That's an insane amount of savings. So I think I kind of want to like maybe start by couponing for makeup, which FYI, Ulta takes coupons. And I don't know. I would love to get to the point where I can coupon mainly for like detergent and pet related items so that I can donate them to shelters because shelters always need detergent to wash all the linens and towels and stuff that all of their little babies use throughout the day. So I think I... I'm like, I'm very intrigued. I don't wanna like overcommit yet, but I found that watching videos about couponing and budgeting tips on YouTube has been so helpful. And for quick on the go tips, TikTok man, I am obsessed. I am beyond obsessed. If you guys have favorite TikTokers, comment below who they are because I like, I'm not even on Instagram anymore, I swear. Like I just wanna watch TikTok because I think it's so fun, it's so creative, and everyone just has such a good time. So that is it for this video. If you guys have a favorite money-saving app that I left off this list, let me know so I can download it and give it a try. I hope that you guys are on track for all of your finance goals for 2020, and I will definitely check back in probably in six months to let you know how I'm still liking all of these apps and how much I've saved. So be sure to thumbs up my video and subscribe down below. Thanks, guys, and until next time, bye.